confession. Nimetoka tu kidogo, nimetoka studio tu kidogo, 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 guys, not even for three minutes. Iyo baridi menipiga. Oh my gosh. Eman James, good morning. Hii joto na shine kusama iko coast. <laughs> Siu kujana ayo hivi yaki, please. It's too much. At what I found Facebook, what I found channel on Twitter, hashtag is why in the morning. My name is Valentine or at color me Valkyrie Busana. So you know it's about that time. We are asking a very, very important question. And the question is, are promises made to be broken? Or why do people break promises? Like for why? Should we even make promises in the first place? Yeah? Hashtag why in the morning. But let me allow my panelists to introduce themselves. So hi guys. Hi. hi. I I'm going to need a little more zest. Hi guys. Uh, Hi. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fine. Thank you. <laughs> Let's start with you. Please introduce yourself. Um, Faith Musoli. On Facebook, find me at Faith. On, on Facebook, sorry, find me Faith Musoli. Twitter, Faith at Faith Musoli. Instagram, Faith Musoli. Mama Lirudi Naswag. Twitter. Twitter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come on. Come on. And you kind sir. Uh, my name is Ken Andrew, and uh, I am a student at this University. Okay. Okay. What do you study? I study uh, communication mm -hmm. and electronic media. Oh, yeah. that sounds fancy. Uh, it, it is not that fancy, but it's what I like. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank you. All right, so tell me what you think about this. Mm -hmm. Why do people break promises? I think people break promises because at times they prioritize themselves, you know. They feel like if I do this for someone, they might feel uh, maybe I love them too much or they might um, feel too confident of their position in your life, you know. So maybe sometimes you decide, let me break this promise and have them a bit to put them in their place. That's what I usually think happens. That is a very confusing answer. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. W no, no, don't be yeah, sorry. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, unapenda mtu sana, so now you break a promise just so you remind yourself see, like, you see, where you're from. Siya tunapenda mtu sana, but mm. umtu anafeel kama unapenda sana. Na umpendi sana. Na umpendi sana. So, so mwambie tu sikupendi hivyo bro. As you, unabreak your promise ndo at least ajue, kuna vitu zingine siya zifaya na umse. No, si lazima umambie umpendi hivyo juhi neza kuwa heartful kushinda kubreak your promise. <coughs> no, that's, that sounds even worse. Nah, to look someone in the eye and to, to like tell them they can't get something, it's heartful than the promise itself, you know. Unaza men thinks up okay break your promise. But kumangalia kwa macho, live live. Ah, that's hard. For me. Sorry. Kabla twendele na e promise breaking. Ebu just help me understand. Would you rather be told the truth like seize kakupai? Um you just be held hanging. Just uh, of course I would rather be told the truth. Ah ah don't uh, say uh, it like that because <laughs> sometimes the truth when it's being told sometimes it's not nice. Yep. I know uh -huh. sometimes the truth is not nice. Mm -hmm. It's not appealing to the ears. Mm -hmm. But that is what it is. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. So if you just tell me that faith, I don't want you, I don't like you, it will hurt me. But at the end of the day, it will help me. There is no need. I, get, I be like, for example, I be in a relationship. Mm -hmm. In a uh, okay, I'm in a in a in a hopeless place. Mm -hmm. There's no need to be in a hopeless place. Mm -hmm. Just set the, the the boundaries, or rather the record right. Mm -hmm. Like if you don't want me, you don't want me. Mm -hmm. Tell it to me. Yeah, but I, I should not live in oblivion. Like <coughs> you love me when you don't. No, I think if the if the promise is broken, the boundaries are set because you'll be thinking in the back of your head, he did this to me last time he can't do it again or maybe you'll have that sort of confusion so you will you will not take the same steps to w you will not do the same thing that made him break the promise or made him promise you something you know exactly. you'll have that but how do you even know it's you did something because mm. let's say you made me a promise to yep. mm -hmm. yep. and maybe i did something that you didn't like yeah. but i have no idea me like for all i know i was minding my own business having very very good time because i i like having good time mm -hmm. and somehow it offended you yeah. so something that we agreed on now is in jeopardy because you saw something you didn't like now niambi we pendi you're you just know. acting you're not talking to me but you yeah. know one thing uh -huh. At times, we ladies push guys into making promises that are not there. Because in the first place, <laughs> see, take it to, you know, so, some ladies uh -huh. will force you into something. And mm -hmm. then they're like, babe, promise, promise. You know, he's telling you, mm. I won't make it. Me but for you, example. Yes. You're like, mm. just promise me that you'll do it. And then the guy says, okay, I promise. Me for example. For example, mm -hmm. 
you've seen your friend with an iPhone. Mm -hmm. You've seen Faith with an iPhone. Mm -hmm. And so you want an iPhone mm -hmm. because your friends have iPhones. Mm -hmm. Then you're pushing this guy, buy me an iPhone. The guy tells you, I don't have the money. But you're insisting you need that phone. Then the guy tells you, it's okay, I'll get you end month. Mm -hmm. Then at the back of his mind, he knows very well, I'm not going to buy this phone. Mm -hmm. But he just doesn't want to tell you because as for you, you don't take a no for an answer. So you just he He's just feeling that vibe. <laughs> <laughs> so he just tells you I'll get you an iPhone. Mm -hmm. Then at the end of the day he tells you, I'm sorry, Faith, I couldn't. Mm -hmm. He has broken a promise, but for him it wasn't a promise per se. He knew he wasn't going to buy you a phone. Yep. But for you as a lady, you just don't, don't take a no for an answer. Okay. Um I'm confused. <laughs> uh, the, the two sides are confusing me. The first mm -hmm. one, why are you stressing somebody's son? Mm -hmm. Why? Yes. Why are you stressing somebody's son to buy for you something you cannot afford on your own? Exactly. It's not fair. It's, it's really not, fair. not fair. But also you, someone's son, why are you not just refusing? Just say, honor, no. Story yeah. is here. Yeah, Why are you there? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, baby. I <laughs> an attack you. will do. I will do. Attack an attack. And I'm pained. Bef before the <laughs> promise is made, <laughs> Uboy and Afakwa strong. Anafakwa na joke and is a fan and a hazy. So before he makes any promises, Anafakwa is sure. Will but you buy me an iPhone? I can't buy an iPhone. So just tell her I cannot buy an iPhone. Whatever happens next, let it happen, you know? Mm -hmm. Life continues. Is there an <laughs> underlying fear that if if you go ahead and say no, instead of making the promise, that mm -hmm. atakwacha. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, because uh -huh. ana fear rejection. Ana fear like, this lady, nikimuambia no, atanikata. But I've seen, she's a good lady. Nina mpenda. She has the qualities of a woman that I would wish to stay with forever. Mm -hmm. And then again, ana, anaona, if I make this promise, maybe it am keep. Mm. So he just says, it's okay. I'll buy you whatever you want. I'll do it. Mm -hmm. But at the back of his mind, maybe he knows that I'll, I'll, I'll not do it. Mm. But mm -hmm. to an extent, something is telling him, you get some money somewhere. So if, you, if just in case I get that money, then I'll buy, him, I'll buy her that phone. So, si ati ajui, si ati ana make promise, yenye anajua atafanya, na anajua hatafanya, it's in between. Yeah. I'll either do it or not, yeah. depending on my financial status. Yeah, but you know, the fear will always be there. But uh, first of all, you know, you should know your financial capability. Before you make promise, when you have a deni, a loan, you have a maybe even after a part of your iPhone, she can, what, what's there stopping her from leaving, you know? Mm -hmm. But at the end, and when we are back in debt, in nini. so before the promise is made, that's the key time, that's the key part. Whom say I'm a strong, I say, I can't get you this, but I love you, you know? Mm -hmm. That's the only thing you can do if you cannot get it. But if you can get it, well and good, go ahead. The story for... But, but it's okay, sorry. But you know, mm -hmm. yep. you can be knowing your financial capability, at that time when you're making that process, that, that promise. Mm -hmm. But towards uh, you uh, fulfilling that promise, something comes in between. And then now you have to break this news to this lady mm -hmm. that I'm sorry something came up. You know, you have mm -hmm. broken the promise despite you knowing your financial status, capability. So pr promises can be broken, not necessarily because you're broke or because something can come up along yeah. the way. Okay. We are often o accused of having very high expectations. Come yeah. on, madam. Yes. But I'm seeing the opposite is also true. Mm -hmm. You also have very high expectations as gentlemen. Mm -hmm. So how would you feel if we are making each other, I made you a promise and then I break it and I don't communicate at all and I'm acting like everything is okay? Uh, yeah, for me, if you break that promise and mm -hmm. you don't communicate, the problem comes in in the part of communication because... Uh, Promises will always be broken. You know, this is human. This is how everything happens. They will always be broken. But if you cannot communicate after and say, give a reason or uh, say something just to, to reassure and keep everything in place, that's where the, the real prob pr problem mm -hmm. comes in for, for the man mm -hmm. to not get a reason and to have a very little communication. But for the promise being broken, yeah, sh as I said before, she can use it as a sign to show that Ah, uh, well, maybe we have this, but not that much, you know? She can use it as a side to, to show her real intentions and something, which, which is okay. And 
according to me, it's very okay mm -hmm. to put someone in their place like that. Yeah. Is it true to say sometimes guys just aim for the shortest that they can't afford? And then they come telling, crying. <laughs> so that means, Ulienda ukomba gari, ukenda ukomba nguo. And I'm not by there making fun of anyone, Tafazali, please. No, that's not what I'm doing. I'm just painting a picture. Mm -hmm. So after Osha, you're just basically presenting yourself as someone that you are not. That's where the story is going. Mm -hmm. Sindio. Mm -hmm. Hiya. Serenade me, oh, I'm in love. Woo! My gosh, I'm telling you, my shortest man, my boyfriend has a car. It's taking me everywhere. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. uh, then one day you just cannot afford to, to upkeep me. Is that a word? You cannot just, you know, maintain the level that you have introduced yourself. And I'm not pointing at him, please. It's not, <laughs> it's not personal. No, no, no. Mm -hmm. It's just in general. Mm. What's the problem? Uh, no, like, see, you want to pay a bit of easy but because you know, confidence, you know, if you feel like Nikki approach you, Dave, you want to get a lesson at Kila Kitun Konao, uh, Nezam Pata, so now, when job is when you are going to have very high on confidence, like, okay, in a group, much to an appointment. Tata! And they will end there with one or two channel and a step up and a Jacob situation in Sasa Lazima. Azima to me your doll, Azima Fanizo Vitu Zote then which sadly oh. one day it in a in Asia too, you know? Mm -hmm. Out of nowhere. Uh, for me, like Kama una jua to always always maintain his or vitu or unizo gari mm -hmm. uh, back seat to to lia to find vitu zingine, chaza ball, kak and what you put his or stuff ju utajeka situation in ye pia we mwen ye utako namka subuna sema, eh hey, janan liko na ido, leo si na so ndafanya nini unakuwa confused una, una, una make a lot of wrong decisions in your life mm -hmm. yeah so if you can't really maintain it just take a step back and let the ones who can do it do it but you know one thing <laughs> you know one thing <laughs> 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 uh, as women or rather ladies we put men into compromising situations mm -hmm. because hiyo tu anakuambia kona gari kona pesa that is what we like to hear mm -hmm. yes because akikuja kesho na kuambie, ha, ah, my dear, ile gari haikuwa yangu. Then you're like, tell me you're lying. <laughs> no. <laughs> tell Excuse me you're me. lying. Excuse me, you think, yeah. eh. that, No, you will not. That is <laughs> the equivalent of saying all men are dogs. So, so umetweka all was turn <laughs> out. No. Okay. no. no. Sam, let me yeah, say I, thank you. I don't mm -hmm. think mm -hmm. the women put the men in those situations. It's the men themselves. Because <laughs> when you're... 20, 21, you understand the the weather of the dating scene and all mm -hmm. the situations and you know if I go into this, I'll have to be like this. Yeah, The, mm -hmm. wi the women uh, they'll always be the same, you know. They'll always want to be shown, to be reassured with things and you cannot blame them for being like that because most deserve it, you know. Mm -hmm. And for a man, if you know you cannot give it to them, you'll be failing her and you'll be failing yourself, you know. Exactly. And also you'll be failing all the men because that's not how it's supposed to go. Yes, exactly. But mm -hmm. there are some, okay, let me use the word some, let me quantify. There are some women mm -hmm. who put men in those situations. Yeah, 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 so. And then there are some men who mm -hmm. put women in, in, in that situation. Yeah. In that, this man comes and tells me, Wamba, Faith, I have a car. Then I fall in love. Mm -hmm. I've fallen in love with the car. Oh, thank you. you. I was going to ask, what are you <laughs> falling in love with? I've fallen friend? in love with his car. Uh -huh. So all along we are riding around, partying, party after party, and then there he comes one day and he tells me, by the way, you're Gary Siangu. <laughs> then I'm like, tell me you're lying. Because why? Come and get one of Gary, then the relationship would have gone so smoothly. Like there wouldn't have been bumps. But then along the way you find yourself like Sasa tutaishi aje, tutakula nini, because this man is now broke, mm -hmm. broke. Yeah. Yet he he was broke the, in the, the first place. The broke is the absent of the car. That yes. is what you are calling broke. Yes. But there are women who see men who don't have cars as broke. Mumekuja sana. Mumekuja sana. Sana, 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 sana. But, okay. Uh, so many questions. So many questions. Let us start with, why are you falling in love with things? And if you are going to fall in love with things, so you get the, your own things. Yeah, you yeah. fall in love with them. You know, <laughs> 
<laughs> especially if you are like 18, 19, 20, 21, uh-huh. um, you still have a, your, your, your better life is ahead of you. You know, you can work towards all those things. You mm-hmm. can have them if you put in hard work, dedication, and you don't have to fall for things that other people have and uh, break their hearts and also not fulfill your dreams and goals because you found someone and you're comfortable som- somewhere. You know, if you do it y- by yourself, mm-hmm. if you work hard uh, with maybe two or three of your friends, your girlfriends or something, you, you can get to a better place than mm-hmm. where you are. Because mm-hmm. when you move forward, mm, because of your own hard work and everything, mm-hmm. everything will be yours, you know. You don't have to depend on someone. You don't have to fall in love with cars or mm-hmm. <laughs> any other things, you know. So yeah, if you're a young girl, if mm-hmm. you're, let's say, to the ages of 30, it, mm-hmm. it is very possible. Even for boys, mm-hmm. it is very possible. You're still not yet at your prime, especially if you're below 25, you can do a lot of things. So you don't have to promise things, you don't have to, to fall in love with other things, to other people before you've really taken care of yourself and you've started heading towards your goals in life. That's mm. it. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to read a couple of your messages. That's at Y254 on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter. Hashtag is Y in the morning. Why? All right, just before they set me up like the way they usually do, <coughs> clear throat. The beginning of, of an interview I just had with a very phenomenal woman, I asked her, what is, like, what's the problem? Like, ah, uh, ni nini, na we umekula life, sindo tunajaribu kungangana kukula hii life. So what is the secret? And she told me something that stayed with me. She said, we, we make promises or we are made promises. We are made? I hope so. Mm-hmm. Yeah with the idea that there'll be no challenges, mm. that it, everything will remain constant, mm-hmm. that, you know, I, I could, okay, let's use each other once more time. So maybe we make a promise before God and our family and friends to say, tunakapa moja sawa. But at some point, forever is a long time, guys. Eh? So I know there's a point I won't really like you. Like, kutako umenifika mahali. Sawa. Kutako mahali. But I made a promise and I need to not be very intentional with that promise. I said I'm going to do this, even though I'm feeling like this. I was, gee, what has happened? Or oh, he's done what? Or mm-hmm. oh, gee, ah. I still have to honor my promise. That is on me. It has nothing to do with you or how you behave or what you look like. I'm sure. the one who made the promise. Yes. Are we together? Yes. Terms and conditions that apply. <laughs> so mm-hmm. let us now read. Mm-hmm. Swali ni kwa nini ngumu aje ku keep promises mbona watu hu break hadi na hadi ni deni okay hashtag why in the morning <laughs> remember you can find us at white five on facebook white five four channel on twitter hashtag is why in the morning so we have a man james good morning star student hashtag why in the morning says promises are worse than lies you just you don't just make your partner believe you also make them hope i got made a promise and i had full hope in it only to be disappointed later life is too short for someone to make use of you okay as we continue but you you see how he's hurt you see because of a promise someone made yeah. but it's the opposite is also true like i could yeah. make you a promise have every intention of yeah. keeping it but somehow COVID-19 just comes yeah. and yeah. I have broken it just like that without yeah. wanting yeah. and and now you're upset but I think the point is communication after communication yeah. after that is key because mm-hmm. you might be intentional it might be not intentional but if you act like you give someone the silent treatment be it your girl your man mm-hmm. your father if you give someone your, the silent treatment after mm-hmm. that's what really ruins the, the whatever relationship you have and then again and then again it depends on uh, how many times this person has been breaking the same same promise. A, a mistake made once is a decision. <laughs> more than once, sorry. Yes. A mistake made more than once is a decision. Yes. I had called Emmanuel Louis Sonko says good morning or in the morning. Well I promises is like new wongo too. Are we politicians? With Joe morning bar. Hi with Joe. Michael Ndela Ndela says morning bar. Hey, tuned in and buy a good topic you brought today. Nayo Hainaga Jibo. Hey, hey, hey. They too vichinjanga vina badilika. Maurice Makoa says kakamega tune. Hey, ati, yeah, hey, promise ningumu waki tu. Acha tu. Masinde Eva says kutoka soy vumilia. Nikondani ya show wala ku promise nikama uongo tu. I think we have 
uh, politicians affecting our, our hearts. <laughs> Those ones who promise you everything. Alafu rukwe kipetero kie kie so with Joe says sometimes ni, in, ni condition you're at the time in a fanya or break promise mostly come ni about cheddars. Hey, money yeah. is running the world. Eh? Mm -hmm. Hashtag why <laughs> in the morning as we continue. Dun -dun -dun. We have Obadia Mutizia and to one day in Kondani. What one a break? I had a maybe Juyarada Kuchafuka. Aha. Timo Bazu was good. Timo Taj says, Vindo Vichanga, Nasu Wongo. David Odera says, Kisumo, sorry to collect ni in Singumu Sana Kukip. Okay, <laughs> Paul Kamala says Taveta Market pre present on the register with Joseph Rero Tund. Rama Love says Paul Susanya is fragile. Oh, my dunga point. Did you pick him a coffee? God, your ping on Mekwana, a rungo J. Jason, a Mekwana Pia Web, a Reverend Tabi, a rungo Jason, I'm a smart. But E. Jason, I know, so I'm not sure if I'm saying it right. Nikubaya, Tabi, what? Tabi, ni mekona ya ni ngumu sana kutimiza ahati zingine ni regrettable. Ooh, ooh. Bede Asle says, macha well tuned. I have marked you present. Musabi Junior says, 026. Uwe? Luhome, I think. Saboti, uh, op opposite. Kitinda beka hati tuned in, I think. Yeah. Okay, hashtag why in the morning. Is is there a problem? Is The bigger the promise, the more the heart? Yes. Or it yeah, is. Exactly. Give me a, a small heart.